For ACSports.com, I'm Austin Gwynn alongside ACU football head coach Ken Collins. And yes, it's football season again. It really has never stopped being football season, I guess, with the signings and then the new stadium announcement. And now we're here for the first day of spring practice. It's football 24-7 here, right? Well, it's pretty much football year round anyway yeah. so it, it's always in season it's just you're doing a little you know you're functioning just in a little bit of different chapter of of, of your book there and right. now we we start spring practice so uh we're fired up about it we had great weather today yeah. uh, guys jumping around uh, having fun today you know we, we didn't have pads so it was more of, of about uh, you know, just a tempo and, and uh, am I lined up right? Do I know my assignment? Mm -hmm. And let's hone in on our steps and and then we'll finish plays a little bit later on uh, when we start putting uh, start putting on the pads. Right. And a lot has been made about the senior class from the fall, leaving obviously a lot of skill position players, a lot of well known names, and probably the biggest hole you have to fill is quarterback with uh, John David um, having used up his eligibility. Uh, what have you seen so far from? Uh, the quarterbacks you have now, you got five of them out here. Well, you know, it's it's football without pads, and nobody's blitzing anybody, and there's no threat that they'll get hit. So it's you know, it's like about summertime throwing, and you know, it's it's not real situational football yet, but it will be. Uh, you know, our guys are making throw, they're making throws on air, so so that's good. But uh, we didn't have any bust really today, and and uh, you know, from the quarterback, so that's good. No injuries either I saw out here too. One face a lot of uh, Abilinians are looking forward to see on the field is Herschel Sims and he'll be eligible in the fall to finally suit up for the Wildcats. And how excited are you about finally getting a guy that played at Abilene High, won a state championship for Abilene High out here in an ACU uniform? Well, I want good players, period. And the fact that he is an Abilene guy just makes it that much more special. Mm -hmm. You know, he's been through some stuff and and uh, this would be a really good way to for him to write his own story and to and, and for it to be an impactful uh you know thing in his life he's going to leave here with a great degree and he's going to play really good football and grow as a person and that's what all these guys are out here for but uh it just happens to be that he's a really good running back so i'm fired up about that one last thought if you look out here you can almost kind of see where the stadium's going to be you know Oh yeah, I don't even have to look. I just close my eyes. You just and, picture and I go it. Go to my happy place. Yes. How crazy. many times did you think about it during today's practice? Just like being able to look out there and well, see in, the stadium. In today's practice, none, zero. Okay. So that means that I'm doing my job <laughs> and you know actually better. coaching the guys that I that I have. So, uh, but no, I, everybody's fired up. I mean, it's just a it's a total game changing situation where, uh, you know, we're gonna we're gonna every year we're gonna take a closer and closer steps. To just to competing at the highest level of the Southland Conference, and we're just we're just walking in the door right now, and it's going to be tough for a while. And uh, and these guys know it they, that we've got all got realistic expectations about this thing, and but it's about growing our football business, and sooner or later we'll get there and we'll be fine. But the stadium is, uh, I mean, that's just you can't think about it without smiling. Right. You know, it's just it's kind of crazy what that does to you. Right. Well, for the first day of spring practice here, be sure to keep tuning into acusports.com. We'll have more interviews from Coach Collins and from a, uh, some different players, different position groups uh, throughout the spring. So stay tuned. For Head Coach Ken Collins, I'm Austin Gwynn for acusports.com.